Okay, TikTokers and YouTubers, this is for educational purposes. I send warnings and invitations. I apologize for how I say this. I do not apologize for what I say. Welcome to Native American Heritage Month. This is like the third Friday in November. And as I told you guys, I was only doing one superhero per week per month. So tonight you get a special because I'm doing one superhero, but they're all the same. Uh, they're all descendants of the guy. So we're doing Red Wolf, one, two, and three, and in the ten minutes. I will not be able to personally identify one from the other, but we're going to show you guys the pictures. This won't um, take too long. So let's get this over with. Um, I guess I probably should have did it individually instead of trying to show y'all a cluster fuck of books. Alright, so this is Red Wolf. I don't know which Red Wolf it is, but this is Red Wolf. Alright. And according to this title, this is also Red Wolf. Sorry. Damn it. I hate technology. Anyway, this is Red Wolf. Yeah. Okay, fuck it. We'll find another picture. <laughs> oh, come on. Just make the image grow. How, how fucking damn hard is that? Like, can you make it bigger? Alright. I'm clearly having tech problems. Oh, come on. So this is Red Wolf. So for the sake of argument, I don't know which one's Red Wolf 1, 2, or 3. But we're just going to go with, this is Red Wolf. Alright. And apparently this is also Red Wolf. That's going to be the last picture, so we can just go ahead and go to his um, fucking Wikipedia, and then we'll, we can go to hell from there. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to read Red Wolf, his Wikipedia, and then we're going to call it. Alright? Alright, so, the superhero identity of several fictional comics appearing in American comic books published by Marvel... Those who assume the identity of the Native American hero and the mystical powers are trusted. Red Wolf, combination name Lobo. He literally has a wolf named Lobo. Alright? So, first appearance, Tall Trees, Avengers, 1980. Where it says, hashtag 801970. Uh, weekly, that's the second one, I believe. Uh, Marvel Spotlight 1, 1971. Unless all this shit is messed up. And then Wild Run. So these are basically the appearances. It is created by Roy Thomas and John B-U-S-C-M-A. And um, Gardner Fox and Sid Shores and Mark Grinwall and Herb Tempe. So here I'm going to spell those names. G R U E N W A L Grinwall, first name Mark Herb Trimpe. I'm pretty sure I butchered that. T R I M P E. I right, alter ego Wild Run Johnny. Excuse me, alter egos rather story information. Wild Run Johnny Weekly Thomas Thunderhead and William Tall Trees. All right, team affiliations. The Agronauts, the Sensational Seven, the Rangers, alias Tall Trees, and Awa Yodeda. I'm not saying that properly. Um, o W A Y O D A T A. The abilities: highly skilled in hand-to-hand -hand combat, experienced wrestler, adept combat gymnast, super archer. Excuse me, superb archer. Expert marksman with throwing weapons and tracker. Skilled animal trainer. Superhuman sensory. A-C-U-I-T-Y. 
we're not going to go into publication history. We're just going to go into fictional biography because that's going to um, take a lot. All right, so Wild Run is in, this, in the 19th century in the Wild West and ordered the Cheyenne, he's a Cheyenne, to place a lev uh, drove the Sioux away from the plains. Cain the Conqueror, the only man who have ever defeated him in battle. As a result, Wild Run's loyalty to Cain became a member of his personal guard in the Argonauts. Avengers Forever, Libra, okay. So, John Weekly, or Wakely rather, is an adopted name of a Cheyenne man who was raised from childhood by a white couple in the 19th century. His adopted parents were unalive by a native retaliation. The U.S. Cavalry massacred their old people, etc., etc. You guys can go to Wikipedia to get all this, by the way. Thomas Thunderhead. Thomas Thunderhead is Red Wolf de Prayer, pre-modern area. Excuse me, pre-modern area, 1970. He helped police officer Jill Tomahawk. Together they battled King Cycle and later Clayton Brickford. Red Wolf is also an assistant of Gabriel Devil Hunter and Dragonfly. So then we have another Tall Trees. Um, not to be mistaken with Shaman, who's First Nations. Alright, so William Tall Tree is a modern born times born Wolf Point, Montana. He is the son of Rebecca Thomas, Rebecca and Thomas Tawtry, Cheyenne tribal leader and grew up hearing the tales of the legendary Red Wolf. William witnessed his father being intimidated into selling this property and a corrupt businessman. Cornelius Lavon Van Lott. I'm going to spell it for y'all. Y'all know how I work. V-A-N-L-U-N-T. And enforcer Jason Birch in the night of Van Lott's henchman unalive Williams family. He swore vengeance in finding the donning of the ceremonial garb of Red Wolf. Oidata? I still can't say this shit. O Y A God damn it. O W A Y O D A T A visited him and then built him the young man with spiritual legacy, granting him superpowers and the new Red Wolf. He found a wolf cub and named him Lobo and trained to be his companion. Following the two criminals back to New York, he was able to gain vengeance on them with the aid of the Avengers. Along with Tagra, Red Wolf battles Super Scroll, the Rat Pack, alongside Phantom Rider 3, Firebird, Texas Twister, and the Shooting Star. He battled the Hawk, he rescued Jack Jones, excuse me, Rick Jones, from the Corruptor. Red Wolf joined these uh, few four uh, adventures in his first incarnation in the short-lived superhero team, the Rangers. Alongside the Defenders, Red Wolf battled some trolls. Alongside the Rangers, Red Wolf battled the West Coast Avengers while under the influence of the demon R-I-G-L-E-V-O, possessing the shooting star. All right. So, for further reference, since I'm only going to give you guys this tonight, um, apparently Tall Trees is a squad. He, he was of, of the Marines at one time. He said in the Vietnam War. And alongside with Willie Lincoln, Josh Cooper, and Jim Rhodes, Rhodey, for those who don't know, along with the name Fong and James, they were in attack the village to result the slaughter of some kind of bingo as an adult. Anyway. Your assignment, if you choose to accept it, is to do more research on Red Wolf. I want to thank you guys for being here. I do apologize. As I said in the prep show, which TikTok doesn't know about, um, I had some co-works pass like last week and this week. So my mood's a little shifty. Plus, all of the videos I made before this about um, Oathbreakers have really soured my mood for tonight. So anyway, happy Native American or American Indian. American Indian Indigenous Heritage Month. For those who are Native, I hope I gave you something to go explore. Because yes, there are Native comics. Well, Native superheroes in comics. Go give them a check out. Thanks for watching. Be seeing you.